welcome back. Today I have this makeup look for you. I really hope you guys like it. It's definitely new to me and just out of my comfort zone kind of because this is all cool tone. I was thinking about creating a makeup look that was just cool tone shades. So I came up with this look because I love purple but I've always been afraid to dive into the cooler tone shades of purple. So I actually used the Makeup Geek Starter Kit. I just bought this a week ago and I've been wanting the starter kit for so long. Don't know why it took me forever to buy it, but Makeup Geek was having a 15% off their site. The sale was only going on for the weekend last week, so I wanted to take advantage and just buy the palette. And these, this is the palette right here. I mean, this is, this is definitely not new but I got it for me. It's new for my collection. I came up with this look using the cooler tone purple shades that you see right here and I just wanted to be creative and also I've been having this Ofra lip for a long time and I just have not created a makeup look for it because I was having trouble coming up to, you know with what colors would look nice with the lip, this lip color. This is Ofra liquid lipstick in the shade and I don't know where it's at. Here it is. It's in the shade Staten Island and I got this a few months back and I thought it was a really really cool color but I didn't know what makeup look or what kind of color combination to come up with this liquid lip. I hope you guys like it. So yeah I really hope you guys enjoyed the look. Don't forget to give the video a thumbs up if you did enjoy it. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and if you would like to see how to get this look then go ahead and keep on watching. Alright guys, so the face is completely done, just foundation. For now, we're going to move on to the eyes. I'm going to start by priming my eyes with the Urban Decay Primer Potion. Next up, I'm taking the Makeup Geek Starter Kit and taking the first shade, which is called Unexpected, a nice cool tone purple shade. I'm going to take this with a crease brush and blend it all over my crease. I'm then taking the lid shade, it's the shade next to Unexpected, and it is called Prom Night with a flat shader brush and applying it all over my lids. And then going back in with a flat blending brush and blending everything into each other. The next shade I'm taking is called Drama Queen, beautiful dark purple with a little bit of shimmer in it. I took a pencil brush and concentrated this in the outer corner and on my lash line and also blended it into the crease and then I'm taking another blending brush, I think this is the E25 by Sigma, and blended it out and then I go back in with the pencil brush and just touch up the color. And then I go in with my blending brush once again and blend everything out. Then I'm going back to Prom Night and I'm going to be touching up the color more on the lid because I feel like it got blended away a little bit. Then taking Corrupt, it's like a nice matte black shadow, I decided to darken up the outer corner just a little bit and also blend it into the crease with my fluffy blending brush. And you'll see me go back and forth just touching up Corrupt on my outer corners. And then taking the shade Shimma Shimma, which is a beautiful shimmery white, and I went ahead and highlighted my brow bone and my inner corners. And then I go back in with the blending brush just to make sure everything's nicely blended. For my brows, I'm taking the Brow Stylist Definer by L'Oreal in the shade Dark Brunette. I've really been loving this a lot lately. And then for liquid liner, I'm taking the NYC liquid liner to create my wing. For lashes today, I'm actually trying a pair from Wish. I actually got these in a bulk. And then I went ahead and moved on to concealer. I'm using the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer in the shade Light. And then used my Beauty Blender to blend it all out. And then I'm setting all the areas of my face with the Laura Mercier Translucent Setting Powder. For 
bronzer today. I'm using the BH Cosmetics Diva Matte Bronzer and just applying it all over the areas and bronzing up my face. For blush, I'm going to be taking Rockateur from Benefit and applying it all over my cheeks. And then to highlight my cheeks, I am taking the Mary Luminizer by The Balm. Not forgetting the nose and cupid's bow, of course. And to smoke out the lower lash line, I went in with Drama Queen and Corrupt and just blended the two together. And then I'm applying Benefit Roller Lash Mascara on my lower lashes. And then applying Shimma Shimma in the inner corners to finish. And then for the lips, I'm going to be taking Over Cosmetics Liquid Lipstick in Staten Island. This shade is so cool tone and grayish that I did not know how to make this work. But I really hope it looks good to you guys. And I think it looks great. I think it pulled the entire look together. But of course, this is the completed look. I hope you guys enjoy it. Don't forget to give the video a thumbs up if you did enjoy it. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And until next time, I'll talk to you guys soon. Thank you guys so much for watching. I used this brush to bronze up my skin and I thought it was perfect for that because when I was going into the areas of my cheeks and around my face, it has the perfect size where it'll just fit right there to bronze up the skin.